This new build is absolutely busted. With Season 21, we got some brand new artifact mods that made Strand Warlock go from strong to absolutely broken. In this build, we will spam Suspend, have Woven Mail, which gives us 50% damage reduction, and nearly infinite unraveling rounds, Threadlings, and Surge mods, giving us some insane damage output. There's a lot going on with this build, so be sure to pay attention to not miss a single step. What's good guys, it's Zen, and if you know me, you know I'm not going to waste your time with these videos, so let's hop right into the build! Now first of all, let's start with our exotic armor of choice, Swarmers. This exotic makes it so Threadlings spawn when we destroy Tangles. It also makes it so Threadlings unravel targets that they hit, giving us a bit of free damage. The exotic perk also activates when we throw our Tangle. Now Tangles are spawned when we defeat enemies with Strand abilities, but they are also spawned by our exotic weapon of choice, Quicksilver Storm. This exotic just does some crazy damage by itself after all the buffs it has gotten. After firing for a while, it activates these grenade launcher shots, and grenade launcher final blows create tangles for us. Now while the combination of these exotics is nothing to laugh at, it's our subclass and artifact perks that truly make it insane, so let's start with the subclass. First we'll start with our aspects. With the brand new aspect, the Wanderer, our tangles attach to targets and detonate a suspending blast. The radius on this blast is nothing to laugh at, but what's really key here is their solo target potential by suspending champions for us like unstoppables. Thanks to our exotic swarmers, they also spawn threadlings doing a bit more damage to enemies nearby. The second part of this aspect reads that threadling final blows create tangles, which gives us an infinite loop of tangle creation. Now unfortunately tangles do have a cooldown, so you'll need to time it right if you want to spam them back to back. Our next aspect will be Mind Spun Invocation, which allows us to consume our Shackle Grenade in exchange for 25 seconds of Weaver's Trance, which grants our weapon suspending blasts after final blows. This aspect gives us some insane ad clear potential. Now this build truly comes to life in our fragments and artifact perks, so let's start with the fragments. First we have Thread of Continuity, which increases the duration of our suspend and unravel effects. Now this is a given, very solid fragment that plays into our build excellently. Thread of Generation gives us grenade energy for dealing damage to targets. Grenade energy gain does not scale with how much damage you do, so sustained weapons like our Quicksilver Storm play excellently into this. Next we have Thread of Evolution, which increases the damage of our threadlings. Finally, we have Thread of Warding, which gives us that 50% damage reduction from Woven Mail whenever we pick up an Orb of Power. This fragment is very powerful and synergizes with some perks that I'll get into right now. Now first we have Strand Soldier, which gives you unraveling rounds whenever you have Woven Mail. This perk is very powerful by itself, giving you free damage with Quicksilver Storm on top of your crazy damage resist. This damage becomes even stronger by slotting on Improved Unraveling, which increases the damage of Unraveling. Now remember, we get Woven Mail by picking up orbs of power, which we will get for multi-kills with strand weapons via strand siphon. This then gives us a 17% damage bonus via strand surge. Now to sum that up, picking up an orb of power gives us 50% damage reduction from woven mail, 17% damage bonus from strand surge, and it gives us unraveling rounds. Absolutely insane stuff. Now I'm gonna get into the mods that increase our power a bit more, then I'll sum up everything this build gives you, because that was quite a lot of information, and I want you to understand how powerful this is and how to use it. Now for your helmet, Heavy and Special Ammo Finder is a given for ammo economy, and again, you'll need Strand Siphon to create the Orbs of Power. Now for your arms, use Heavy Handed to give you an additional method to create Orbs of Power. Fastball will allow you to have better range on your Shackle Grenade, and Strand Loader is just here as filler. Keep in mind, these artifact mods reduce the cost of Strand Loader and Heavy Handed to 1. Now for your chest, just use whatever resistance mods will help you with the activity that you're about to run. Now for your legs, again, you'll want 2 stacks of Strand Surge for the 17% damage bonus, you'll also want elemental charge which has a chance to give you armor charge when destroying a tangle. Now for your class item you'll need time dilation which extends the duration of your strand surge and we'll top off the build with bomber for grenade uptime. Your other weapons don't matter much at all, you could use a hatchling weapon and it would technically synergize but honestly your best bet is using whatever will help you stun champions for your energy and probably an arc rocket since there is an arc surge all season. Now let's explain one more time everything that's going on and what to do so you are fully utilizing this build to its maximum potential. Now, now there are three main signs to this build. Tangles, Orbs of Power, and Shackle Grenades. Now you can spawn Tangles by defeating enemies with Strand abilities, Quicksilver Storm's Grenade Launcher mode, 
or Threadlings. Threadlings spawn when destroying or throwing tangles, giving you great ad clear and free damage. Threadlings also unravel targets they damage, giving you more free damage. Finally, throwing a tangle will have it attached to a target and detonate into a suspending blast. Next, Orbs of Power are created by rapid Quicksilver Storm kills or a melee kill. Keep in mind, Quicksilver Storm's grenade launcher mode can get these rapid kills very easily. Now when we pick up an Orb of Power, we get Woven Mail, giving us 50% damage resist, Unraveling Rounds, which gives us free damage on enemies for Quicksilver Storm, and a 17% damage boost to Quicksilver from Strand Surge. Finally, by consuming our Shackle Grenade, we get 25 seconds of suspending explosions for getting final blows. With all of these combined, we have insane damage, sustain, and ad clear. We have truly achieved Strand Warlock perfected with this build. And that's gonna be the build, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to subscribe for daily Destiny 2 videos. Either way, thanks for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow for the next video. Peace.